All right, well, also another update here. The patient who underwent Neuralink's first human trial back in January can now reportedly control a computer mouse just by thinking. That's straight from the company's founder, Elon Musk, the founder of Tesla here, who had provided an update last night during a Spaces session on the social media platform X, formerly known as Twitter. But this is a massive milestone. It's hard, Brad, you and I have been talking about this all morning, just trying to wrap our heads around this, just in terms of how big of a step, how significant this is for the technology. And Elon Musk went on to say that the progress that they have seen so far, comparing that to what they set out to achieve is, quote, good. He also went on to explain the fact that the patient is suffering, quote, no ill effects that the company is aware of just yet. I mean, mind blown here at the end of the day. You think about what additional advancements this could really kind of permeate out to even further here. Of course, the focus initially on making sure that for anyone who had a disability that kept them from being able to operate, you know, certain limbs or parts of their body, that this perhaps could be a way forward forward now there's a larger question too of where else this could play out in, in science and medicine as well I mean but at least on the onset of just hearing some of the early successes I mean many of us having the same reaction that our stage manager Mike did where we're just sitting here SMH shaking our head trying to figure out how this is possible uh, but we're getting even more data to come forward it'll be interesting though to see further how some of the testing gets expanded this is just the first patient um, but you got to wonder okay who else is going to raise their hand step forward and um, ultimately feel comfortable enough in some of the early phase trials there too yeah certainly the company previously saying that the implants would allow uh, people to be able to complete tasks just using their thoughts so certainly this seems like a step in that direction also helping treat a certain medical condition so uh, an amazing uh, step forward here for this technology, at least what we know so far.